Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, traders from across the globe. Welcome to the 2104th edition of Short Term Trading Live with Oscar Carboni. Traders, good evening. It's Sunday evening. Thank you so much for tuning in. Love you cats. Love your comments. Appreciate your views and appreciate your work at my live trading room. So thank you, thank you, thank you. This video, the 2104th video coming at you on a Sunday night for trading Sunday through Monday, May 18th, 2020. As you know, if you don't know, listen up. This is a very risky endeavor, trading futures, trading options, trading stocks, trading ETFs, trading anything these days is extremely risky. It's certainly not suitable for all trading accounts. You must put your stops in first so that you've got protection before you trade, and you must have money earmarked to be lost when you play this game, just in case that happens. If you understand those risks, that makes you a trader. And let's move forward, baby. Let's see what's going on. So, for trading on 518, tonight into tomorrow, Omni wants me to continue to buy the dips in E-mini S&P. And if it deeps, if we get a deep enough dip, I will buy the, e the NASDAQ. We'll see what happens. It's got to be a deep dip, though. Down, down, down before we get involved. Number two, silver goes bonkers and gold looking strong too. Now, I came out in front of this video, in front of this camera, last week, and I said, look, silver's a dog. It's been a dog my entire 38 years I've been in this business, 39 years, whatever the number is. But every dog has its day, and I think silver looks good. That was last week. Silver exploded on Friday. Go silver, gold looking strong as well for trading on Sunday through Monday. Then we've got number three on the board, Google, and another stock, Fastly, F-S-L-Y. This is my gift to you, Omniacs, because we can look at Google, but it's a $1,300 to $1,400 stock. How many of us can afford that? This one, $39, bucks, right in line with very cheap, easy to trade. So let's see if you like the charts. That's Fastly, F-S-L-Y. It's a cloud-based company. Basically, they are a techno company, right? It's computer technology, cloud-based, out of San Francisco. But so far, so good, and their volume isn't bad either, so we'll look at those charts together. Traders, I'm about to show you some charts. Remember, a live trading room exists at live with Oscar.com. The trading room is free, no credit cards, no nonsense. Just come hang out with me and we'll get through these rough and tumble days together as a group. It'll cost you nothing to get educated, to stay with people that are really good at what they do. My trading room has fantastic traders in it. I'm at the helm and again, it's nothing. It's free to you, so come on and check it out. All right, so what are we gonna do? We are about to go look at some silver and gold charts Maybe an S&P chart just to keep the indices involved. And we'll look at Goog and FSLY. With no further ado, let's go look at some charts. Traders, E-mini S&P daily bar chart. Even though it gave us a little bit of a scare last Thursday, on Friday it came back up. Well, I should say Wednesday. Thursday it came down and came back up, and then Friday we settled inside of this channel. Once again, it stayed in the channel. And Omni has not turned bearish. It went from neutral to slightly bullish. So if we get a chance, we will buy dips in either E-mini S&P, Russell, NASDAQ, whatever sets up. But I just wanted to show you where at least we are back in the channel for now, and hopefully it'll move a little higher. Next on the board is gold. And look at that bad boy stuff to go, huh? Gold looking good. That is my trade for the day. If I can get long gold on a dip for trading Sunday night to Monday, I will. Then we've got silver traders. Here's where silver was. I put the chart in front of you and I said, look, I've been trading silver or at least I've been around silver since 1982. And it's the same price today it was in 1982. It never goes anywhere. But every now and then silver does have a rally. And that's what I left you with on Thursday for trading on Friday. Here's Thursday's chart, so here's where it was, and this is what happened on Friday. I mean, come on. Who can do that? What a great call. So, and we have higher projections. You know, you can probably get somewhere into the 1760s before you run into trouble in the silver. Let's see what's going to happen. 
And then there is Google. Traders, this chart looks fantastic to me. You had two down days, got right to the bottom of a channel, got right back into that bear, into that buy mode above the bottom of the channel. You don't usually get more than two days down anyway before something happens on the upside, right? Two days down, something happened on the upside. Well, you had two days down, maybe something now begins to happen on the upside. So I like Google, but you know, between thirteen and fourteen hundred dollars is the price of this stock gyrating. Can you afford that? Even the options? I don't know. A lot of people can't afford that stock. But you can afford this one. Traders, look at Fastly. Now, I'm not saying this is a great company that's going to do anything. I am an analyst. I'm showing you a chart. I don't, I don't even care what the company does, even though we know it's a cloud-based company. But this chart looks fantastic, and it's got projections higher. And it's only $39.50 right now, so it's an affordable stock. Keep your eye on Fastly. See if you like that. I'm not telling you to just run out there and buy it. Keep an eye on that. That could be a stock for you to trade for a little while. Traders, that's what I wanted to show you. Fastly is my gift to you. Google as well, but this one's much more inexpensive getting in. You know what I'm saying? So let's finish this video, and we'll get to work in my trading room. Okay, traders, you've seen the charts. You've got my reasoning why we will look to buy dips in NASDAQ or one of the indices if they set up. Silver still looking great. Gold looking even better. I'm not a big fan of getting long silver as much as I am gold when it dips. And you've got Google and Fastly on the radar. Now, if you haven't been thinking about this, traders, every time you go out your door and go to a store, I mean, how much more plexiglass do you see in the store? It's everywhere, right? Partitions, there's plexiglass everywhere. It's here, it's there, it's everywhere. It's on the side of you, it's in the front of you, it's in between you. There's plexiglass going up everywhere. And it's not just in my city or my state. It's every state in the United States. It's every country on the planet. Everyone's installing plexiglass. So if you can figure out how to get long some stocks that make, there is no pure plexiglass play. I've looked all weekend. There's no pure plexiglass play plexiglass play, I can't find one. Like a single stock, I make plexiglass, this is what I do, can't find that. But I did find a whole bunch of makers of that material to look at. So just wanted to mention it to you, it's one of the many areas we're going to make a lot of money off of this corona thing. If you just think about it correctly, first thing I'm going to tell you is go look at plexiglass. If you could figure out how to get in that industry somehow, Boy, are they using a lot of that for the next six months, so see what happens. All right, traders, again, live with Oscar.com, my live trading room. I'll hang out there all day and night. You'll find me there. If you get a chance, come to live with Oscar.com and drop in and say hello to me. Everybody else, thank you so much for everything that you do in my trading room. Thanks for watching the videos. Please don't forget subscribe to these videos subscribe right now so that you can get an alert every time i put out a new video because these videos are really geared to be traded like right away after you watch them and if you don't mind promote like and share these videos for me on the internet i could use a much bigger crowd compared to the crap that's out there there are some thieves as you know and you know what i'm talking about that try to do videos like this but these cats don't know anything and they've got these huge crowds of people that they're ripping off and me, if you've been watching these videos since 2006, there is no one that can come near me. I mean, the Omni, you can't touch it. No one on the street comes close. And our crowd is small. I don't understand. Anyway, if you can help promote these videos, like them, get some fans to see us. Join me at LiveWithOscar.com. And remember, keep your emotions out of trading. One of the best things you can do to help keep those emotions at bay, and I know it's not easy, they drive you nuts, especially when you're in a bad trade, but at least do this. Place your stop first, then say this to yourselves every morning, every afternoon, every evening, and you know.
Traders, thank you for tuning in, and I will see you all at LiveWithOscar.com. Past performance is not indicative of future results. Futures trading is risky and can cause substantial financial loss. We do not claim or guarantee that you will profit from the information provided.